welcome you all to today's modular classroom this video is specially dedicated to kavita bharati one of our subscriber who requested on how we can allow the respondents to submit any particular file in the google forms so let us take a google form and we can give a specific title upload file so here we can ask the basic requirements as name and in the next field we can ask an email and in the next question we can ask upload file and in the choice we can select the file upload and once once when we select this it will ask the respondents upload the files to drive files will be uploaded to the form owners google drive when the respondents submit this particular file this file will be uploaded to the google drive of the owner so this will be so saved to our drive usually the file drive size is 15 gb and once when we click on continue it will ask us Uh, allow only specific type of files if we enable this it, you can select a document type or a pdf or any presentation or any image whatever file type you wish to enable you can select and the number of files which varies from 1 to 10 if you select one you can ask the respondents to submit one file if you give five they can upload up to five files and maximum file size it starts from minimum 1 mb to 10 gb but always make a note that if you select 10 gb there should be a file size which is available so because uh, the size limit will not be available totally we have 15 gb of uh, memory space which is allocated for a drive and if you are already using 6 to 7 gb so totally this uh, 15 gb will not be available so always make sure if you want to collect responses from 10 users and if you are selecting 10 mb Uh, if you are uh, allowing 10 users 10 into 10 100 mb will be used so always ensure that particular files uh, science is available in your drive space so that the respondents can submit your files of that required file even when you uh, this especially when you select the video file to be uploaded you should you should be very clear on the drive space which is available so once you search give all these details you can go for a preview and once the user respondent will able to enter their name email they can select any e email and they can upload a file add file so they can select any file which will be uploaded to our drive So once I click on submit, that file will be available in our drive. So you can find one response is made, and you can view that particular file. So you can find that file upload is saved in the drive, and the drive link is saved in the Excel respondent. So once when you click on this link, you will be able to find that file which is uploaded. so this is how you can allow the respondents this is how you can allow the respondents to submit any particular file of the type which you wish so thanks for watching stay tuned